Okay, to, today I'm changing the fuel filter on my Volkswagen Transporter T5 2008 model. It's a 1.9 litre engine and the fuel filter is this one there. Uh, first of all, we need to move the coolant expansion tank, so I need a couple of Torx screws to remove he here and here. So to remove the expansion tank, two torque screws here. You either get a torque key, torque socket attachment, and it's a T20. Once unscrewed, just gently wiggle it a bit out of the way, and then you can get to here. And I think there are some. It is screwed in tightly somehow. Just on the behind there, can't quite see it. There's a what is that? Nut and bolt, it feels like. Down at the back, need to undo that just to loosen the frame around the filter. Okay, so used a 10mm to undo this, loosen this little nut down. Back there, and see if I can zoom in. Yeah, it just, it just tightens this. Yeah, just down there. Just all it does is tighten this to hold the uh, filter in. Here's a new one, new filter. See, it's got RT, VM, RF, whatever that is, VF goes in that way with the letters facing yourself. These hoses are pretty impossible to put in the wrong place uh, because of the shape and length of them. And basically you push the coloured bit and they will release. Uh, it is filled with diesel so have somewhere to put the filter when you take it out. And you use two hands, pack it with some tissues or something around for Okay, so this is what I mean. You get a tool or something, push that blue one in, and it releases releases it from the end here. And there's one on each of them. Just push them out, and it can pop off. Now, while I'm doing this, a bird decided to shit on me. Right there. Anyway. Here's how they go in, and you see the push button is in front, in front, in front, and this one's on the side. And this is what I mean, once you take it off, there's really no kind of option to go wrong, because they just won't fit anywhere else. So uh, anyway, try and keep it nice and clean, I guess, and pull this filter out. I remember it is filled in, filled up with diesel. Uh, I can guess about a litre or so of diesel. So I have a bucket or somewhere to put it in. Uh, don't just dump it in the grass. Putting them back on. Push the clip in. And when you push it down, it should be a nice, solid, com comforting clip there. Click. Push it in. You hear the click there. And again, this one. And it's a bit awkward that one. I think you need uh, something else to push that at the same time. There it goes. The filter. System is uh, self priming. You turn your ignition switch to the first setting, not not switch on the engine, just to the first setting. Um, you can hear zoop and do that a few times. Why did that come? And that'll be filling up the fuel filter. 
open up. Lost a bit of tissue down there. Ah, come on, you bugger, get out. Sometimes you need skinny arms with eyeballs on the end of your arms. Anyway, that's the fuel field here. Need to put the coolant tank back, back in place. And then refill, so, well, check the oil if it's all come out the bottom. Put something up back in and then refill. Okay.